All right, what we've got here is a very, very common tree species that we see uh, here in Newton County. And this is the water oak. Uh, scientific name of water oak is Quercus nigra. And uh, this is in fact an oak tree that is deciduous. Um, you could, that means it leaves as it leaves in the, uh, in the winter. And the leaf shape of this is what we call a spatulate. You know, I learn it, uh, spoons and spatulates. And so it's very, very common. I'm almost certain that you've got one near your house. The arrangement for the oak tree would be alternate. You can see that it kind of alternates back and forth. Oak trees are gonna be classified in the two, in two different families. You got red oaks and you have white oaks. And if you're interested in hunting, it's important to know that the, the acorn production uh, for, for oak trees, which you know hunters and deer love acorns, that uh, it basically alternates. So if you really wanted uh, a great acorn production on your property, you would want a healthy mixture of red oaks and white oaks because one year the red oak family will basically have a bumper crop of acorn production, but the white oak acorn production will be low. And then it kind of flip flops back and forth. It's kind of on like a two to three year cycle. There can be a little, there can be a lull year in between. But uh, anyway, this one is in fact in the red oak family. It does produce acorns. It is a very strong lumber. Typically, whenever you talk about hardwood, oak furniture, this is one of the ones that can be used and, and it is often used. Um, it's a great shade tree, it, you know, great, great plant to put in your yard, but they, uh, they are very, very common and they will hybridize between the oaks. So you'll get a little bit of hybrid um, variations, but very, very unique tree, uh, unique leaf spoons and spatulates, you know, little little spatula there, and uh, very common. So again, water oak, Quercus nigra.